Tom Bartek has dedicated his professional career serving and protecting the lives of others. I'm a firefighter and my job is to basically pull the hose off the, the engine and go put out the fires. Fighting fires in the Omaha community for the past 20 years, Tom filled his days off with other adrenaline-fueled activities like bull riding, a passion that spawned at an early age. Ever since I was a little kid, I just was always fascinated by rodeos and especially bull riding. Tom combined his childhood passion with his adult servant heart by competing in an annual bull riding fundraiser for the Muscular Dystrophy Association. I remember actually getting on the bull. One guy was spotting me, one guy was pulling my rope, and uh, I remember that, and I remember nodding my head to let's go, and then that was it. Just moments into his eight second ride on the back of Hell's Bells at the Sarpy County Fairgrounds in Springfield, Nebraska, he and the bull collided. He kind of came up and caught me right in the, in the face. I actually was wearing a helmet with a mask and uh, I think it was a significant enough blow that it knocked me out. Tom sustained a severe brain injury, leaving him in a coma in the ICU. Tom's wife, Dina, kept family, friends, and the community updated on Tom's condition through a CaringBridge page. Six days later, she posted news that Tom was heading to Madonna's Omaha campus to get his life back. Tom's accident and hospitalization left him extremely weak, especially on his left side. I initially thought my hand was broken, and then the, the nurse told me, no, sweetie, that's your brain not telling your hand what to do. Early on, he struggled with his new reality of relearning simple tasks like tying a shoelace. You get really mad and frustrated, and then you kind of get scared, like, am I ever going to be able to do this again? Slurred speech, eating, and swallowing also proved difficult to overcome. I remember eating pureed meat, that was terrible, you know, just, it, I just, you just want to have a steak or a burger or, you know, something, you just couldn't do it. Speech therapists incorporated Tom's meat-eating goals into his care plan, starting with power bars and beef jerky sticks before graduating to a steak dinner. Tom also developed the key phrase, lock it down, his care team could use when Tom's concentration needed refocusing. Physical therapy incorporating specialized technology developed by Madonna called eye care allowed Tom to regain strength and stamina, which is exactly what he needed to get back to his career as a firefighter, husband, and father to Josie and Gabe. Being able to play with my kids and play catch with my son and basketball with my daughter. His determination never wavering. Tom continued working hard and fine tuning his skills in outpatient therapy Thankful that Madonna was just down the street from his home. It's just a state-of-the-art facility with, more importantly, great personnel who, who work here and how much they care and how knowledgeable they are and how much concern they have for you. And they, they want you to succeed almost as much as you want to succeed and get back to life. Just eight months after his accident, Tom returned to active duty with his work family at Fire Station 31 in Omaha. Everything I do on a daily basis, I sit there and I think, oh, I couldn't do that, you know, a year ago, and now I can. And it's, it's all because of all these awesome people who helped me out, of, you know, immensely just feel to, to do simple things that you take for granted.